Today is day all day 10. Woke up at 6 in the morning, per usual, besides yesterday. <laughs> uh, we did a weightlifting workout this morning. It was a heavy circuit, so it was pretty easy. Just 8 to 12 reps. Uh, yeah, and beforehand, we did a little bit of running. But, you know, here they like running at a fast pace. At least if you're in group one. Um, I had breakfast. Pretty much the same thing every day. I had biscuits and gravy. Cantaloupe. I actually tried a breakfast pizza this morning. It was kind of interesting. Put eggs and sausage and like make it into a pizza. It was kind of yummy. Kind of not. Yeah. Um, and then we had hard practice in the morning today from about 10 20 to 12. They yelled at us for being slow because we had a day off yesterday. They were like, you guys forgot how to work over the break. Which I don't, I don't believe. We're still working pretty hard. Um, so yeah, we did hard drilling live. Hard practice gets easier. On the first day, you feel like you're gonna die, but by now, it's just kind of like normal. <laughs> um, so yeah, I scooted on back to the place, got here first, took a shower, left for lunch, had some chicken. And then we had just technique later that day. Good news. My elbow may not need to be taped that much anymore. And the thing on the back of my leg is cleared up. So I don't have to see the trainers anymore. Which means I don't have to show up 45 minutes early to every single practice. Hallelujah. Technique, we just did setups to double legs and how to finish if you hate heads between the two legs. And then we ate dinner. The ice cream machine broke, which was a sad day for a nation because I really like ice cream. I... Yep, and then we had a workout tonight. Group four through one did. The other four had a view. Today we uh, did like a three mile tempo run at like a six minute mile pace. It was ridiculous. Our counselor just took off. And then we did laps around the tennis court doing 15 push ups at each corner and it added up to 500. So we did 500 push-ups after the tempo run. And we had a good little talk. Just about uh, achieving your goals and stuff. We had this guy from Oklahoma State come in. He was an All-American. Told us about his story, about how he was a freshman. He uh, didn't do as well as he hoped, and then he won three state titles and two Fargo titles. And that he uh, then didn't do as well as he hoped in college, and now he's trying to out for the Olympics. Um, so yeah, I came back, did my journal, now I'm ready for bed. That's it.